Welcome to Abes. That's how you say that, Abes. The signs up here. Uh, this is the deepest station in the Paris Metro. It's at uh, 36 meters or 118 feet below ground. And it's located on the western side of the hill of Montmartre. So when you get off this stop, just take a moment to look around. Don't let the crowd rush you. Um, it's worth a moment just to take in the space. Um, it's like super airy and the vault is adorned with these ceramic tiles. Um, they stretch from one end of the platform to the other. And the name of the station is inscribed on white earthenware on a blue background. It's very uh, unique to this station. If you're up for a little walk, because this is so deep, you have the option to go with the elevator or the stairs. And I would suggest the stairs. And I'm gonna show you why. <laughs> Just a minute. Yep. <laughs> 181 steps. Let's do this. This is why I suggest you use the stairs. I'm just going to videotape it up and listen to some music on the way up. I'm not going to talk. It's hard enough as it is with two masks on. So I hope you enjoy this stairwell.
So do you remember when I took you to the Marche the other day and I showed you that Orthodox synagogue? It was designed by Hector Guimar. And he also designed this. The station was opened on January 30th, 1913. And uh, it's one of the only two remaining glass covered dragonfly entrances. They're known as Ecoules. And even though this is a Grimar, <laughs> kids just getting out of school, a Grimar original, it was actually originally located at the Hotel de Ville. And they moved it here in 1974. This neighborhood's so pretty. Montmartre. So I'm bringing you here because this is the station that you come to for the rest of this series. And from here, we're going to go and visit, right across from it, the Love Wall. I'm gonna show you this tomorrow. So many people miss this. <laughs> it literally is, you pop out of the station right here, right? Turn around and there's the Love Wall. But just this place, when you first come up, Montmartre, feels like a village separate from Paris, but in the middle of her. So I'm going to share with you two links to some fantastic articles online about this metro station. Now they're both in French, but you can use a translation tool to read them. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow.